Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and what I wanted to review and talk to you about is actually Village Candle. Now, Village Candle can be found in either your home goods store, your Marshall store, your TJ Maxx store, but because I guess the area I live in, I'm lucky enough to have it in my local grocery store. Some local grocery stores probably in your neighborhood have Village Candle available. They of course have their own website as well as um, availability in stores. Now I wanted to talk to you about them because uh, I know sometimes they're overlooked or maybe not overlooked. They shouldn't be overlooked when I first purchased a candle from Village, I got it from my local home goods store, and it happens to be this one, which is Crisp Apple. Yeah, it's home goods. And I wanted to try it. It's a 26 ounce jar. It's paraffin wax. The price was awesome, $9.99. And it's a two wick candle. Initially, when I purchased it, the smell, I love apples, love apples. I especially love crisp, tart, Granny Smith apples. So when you smell this, that's what you get immediately, a Granny Smith tart, tart, tart apple. Um, took it home, started burning it, and pulled up beautifully, except to my dismay. See these little wicks? Unfortunately, the candle wick started to um, drown. Um, I I was a little upset because the scent throw on these candles, on Crisp Apple Village Candle, powerful, powerful scent throw. But when they started to drown and get tiny and, and just diminish in the pool of wax, um, I was sad. But my only resolve and the only thing I could do was I blew out the flames and I had my wax melter close by, put a paper towel underneath, my wax cup on top or the little wax melter cup, poured it carefully, the melted wax, into the cup and wiped it clean and... I could see wax wicks again. See my little wick sticking up a little bit? Now, unfortunately, only with this one, I don't know why Village Candle, I experienced such problems. The only re result from doing this is I could not only get scent from this, I could, when I was melting the, the leftover wax from this, um, or the overabundance of wax, um, I could smell it in my wax warmer and I could smell it in the candle. So that's the only thing that I have to tell you about Village Candles. I don't know, no, I will tell you this. I called up Village Candles specifically thinking that, oh my, it's because I got it in home goods and maybe they have like their lower quality ones in home goods and they do make candles or they distribute to home goods and um, and I asked him about the wicks and I said, if I were to buy from you directly, will the wicks be any better? And they said, no, the wicks are the same. And I even checked my local grocery store thinking, oh yeah, they're like $18 instead of $9.99. Maybe they're, no, they're the same wicks. So I had to let you know about this. But I didn't want you to pass it over and think that just because it's in home goods that it's any less of a good throwing scented candle as Yankee is because not true, not true people. It's an awesome company and it gives awesome th throw. Wonderful. And it's 26 ounce. 26 ounce compare it to Yankee which is a 22 ounce candle and $9.99. Now I have this in uh, crisp apple which I said is like a tart apple scent. I also have it in mulled cider. And I experienced, unfortunately, the same thing. I actually just, you can't see it, but when I said I poured it out, blow out the, the, the wicks, um, 
and carefully pour it into your wax warmer. And I cleaned this one as best as I could. And then I relit it and the wicks get a little taller just for the brief moments. And the throw is awesome on these. Um, mold cider. Now sometimes when I have a candle that doesn't have a lot of throw, the scent is very light, especially an apple scent. I usually either light this one with it or the mold cider because it just pushes the fragrance through the rooms better. I'm not going to lie, this one will overpower most of the time any candle that it's playing with. This is a strong thrower. This is a strong thrower. But I wanted to let you know that if you see these in your home goods store or your Marshalls or your TJ Maxx, pick them up. Take off the top. Smell them. You're going to enjoy the fragrance. They're strong throwers. They're really good. Uh, the only thing is you might experience the wick, the baby, you know, the, the teeny wick problem. But if you have a wax warmer, you get like two for the price of one in a way. But just make sure that you blow out the wicks first, of course, and carefully pour out the stuff. And you're going to have a good, you know, it's, it, to me it's pretty good. Um, something strange, I went to my local TJ Maxx store and I noticed that they had Village Candle there, and they had one called Egyptian Sandalwood, which is, I know it's on their website. They had another one called Northern Pine, which is not on their website. It smells like Christmas trees. And they have Autumn Wreath now in both Marshalls and TJ Maxx. I don't know whether or not I'll try it. Who knows? Maybe. But see this mull cider? They have one called Apple Jack Cider. And it sort of smells like this one. And I asked the um, associate, when I called up Village Candle, I asked about it. And they said they don't know what I was talking about. But I had to go to the store again for something else. And I looked to make sure it wasn't another two-wick candle. But it was definitely a Village Candle Applejack Cider. But it smelled just like mull cider. Who knows? I, I don't know. But that's what I wanted to let you know. Uh, don't overlook Village Candle. They have beautiful scents, um, great scents throw, gorgeous, strong, powerful, wonderful price if you get them from your local um, home goods store. One thing about, I mentioned that they sell them in the grocery stores. They do sell them in the grocery store. The only thing that's different than the grocery store ones, besides price, they're going to be a little bit more in there. Um, than a home goods is they have a tremendous variety in the grocery store. You're going to see different fragrances that you probably will not see um, in the home goods. You're going to see different sizes. You're going to see votives, small ones, small of this, this size. Um, I don't know if they have the smooth wax. I know they have different shape waxes, but I like the fact that they have the votives there. Um, because it's just a great way to buy, purchase a small candle and see what it's like. Also, Village Candle site itself, sometimes they have sales. I know they had a Labor Day sale. I missed it, but sometimes they don't. But they're, they're a good price, really. They're still cheaper than Yankee Candle. Even the 26-ounce one is cheaper when you buy it from their website. But that's what I had to let you know. Don't overlook this one. Village Candle is pretty good, and it throws fantastically well. And there you go. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.